Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jewel Tolentino here. All right, so in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how to use templates in Camtasia 2020. All right, so if you don't even know how to get templates, where they are, what they are, you guys can check out this tutorial that I have right here before watching this one. Uh, this is the tutorial on how to download uh, the templates for Camtasia 2020. And they do have free ones as well. And in this tutorial, I show you guys how to download them and load them up into Camtasia. All right, so once you've loaded up your template in Camtasia, it's gonna look something like this, depends on what template you have. I have this template right here. I'll go to File and go to uh, Manage Templates. And it's this one right here. It's the one that's brand awareness and it's it says like five quick tips. So if you don't know how to get a template or load it up, please watch the previous tutorial, which will be down in the description below on how to get templates. All right, so we've got this one loaded up here and I wanna show you guys how to basically go and edit something like this so that you can get a cool video. So I'm gonna play it right now so you can see what it looks like and I've not edited anything yet. Okay, so basically this template is kind of like a listing type video. So you can see right away it says, uh, where is it? Five quick tips and then it starts going into tip one, tip two, tip three, all the way up to tip five. And so that's a great template to use if you have a video where you wanna, you know, five quick tips on how to lose weight or whatever it is that you're gonna be doing a video on you can use a template like this. So let's go in and start editing this template. So first thing for me is the song choice. I'm not really into this music here. We can play it a bit. Yeah, it's a little bit too mellowish country and that's not really the theme of our brand and channel. So I want to get rid of this music and you can totally customize everything on this template. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna click on this and I'm gonna delete that. Now, if I, if I want it back, I, I have it here in the audio. It is part of the media, but I have this other song which I loaded up into our media bin here and I'm gonna load that up. So I like this song better. Something like this. That's a little bit better for our theme. So I changed the music and uh, the music that we get is copyright free music and we actually get that from a website called Artlist. And if you guys wanna check uh, a review video of Artlist, I also will have that down in the description below. It's basically a subscription model where you have unlimited access to copyright free music and it's good quality. And if you are editing videos on a consistent basis, whether it be vlogs or videos for clients, which we do both of, um, we decided to get a subscription from Artlist and that way we can just download whatever free copyright free music and not have to worry about getting any copyright claims or anything like that. So first thing, change the music. Now let's change the beginning part. So wherever you click, you can see that you can edit uh, the different parts that are happening. So right here, this is the background and the background is white. And then if I click over here, you can see that these colors are representing, you know, the shapes that are happening on the screen here. So I'm probably gonna change some of this to our brand colors. So let's say, and I'm just, I'm doing this on the fly here. So let's just see, maybe change that to black. Cause our colors are, uh, black, purple, and white. So I'm trying to configure the colors here. Maybe this can be a white. And okay, let's see what that looks like. Kind of cool. I'm okay with that for now. This is an example video. 
So now I'm going to head over to this section here and I'm just going to be moving in order from the beginning to the end. So I'll click this here and you can see it matches up appropriately. This is the number, the title, the description. So I'm going to say, um, it's, it says here five quick tips to help you do something. <laughs> so let's change this title here. Uh, five methods. Let's see here. Methods. Uh, to make money on, wait, from your YouTube, this might be too long, YouTube channel, let's see, it's all about playing, oh, no, okay, five methods, I'm, I'm literally just playing around here, five methods to make money, and then I'll say here, from your YouTube channel, this might be also still too long. Okay, now the top part is too long. Let's go back there. Five methods to monetize your channel. Five methods to... Okay, so I finally got it to uh, fit here and I've got here five methods to earn from your YouTube channel. So I've changed that. And you can also change the color and the fonts and the sizes. I guess I could have um, changed uh, the size as well to make the letters fit. But I will change this purple to this purple. I'll change that pink to this purple. And I'm okay with this gray font here. And you can literally change the alignment, the size, the actual font. I'm okay with everything else for now. Let's click on this here. This stuff I don't really need to touch. If you really, really want to go into full, full detail, you can touch the shadowing and everything like that. But I'm okay with just mainly the colors and uh, the actual text. So we'll leave that as is. Five methods to earn from your YouTube channel. And I'm just going to do like the first two because this will take a long time to go through the entire thing. But let's just do like the first two. And let's head over here. What's this thing? Oh, this is also the circle. They have another circle thing again. So let's alter the colors again. So I turned this pink into black. And I turned this blue into white and that we'll leave that one like that. So let's play this now from the beginning and see what it looks like. Okay. Nice. It's already branding well. Okay. So now down here where it says placeholder, it says drag media to replace. So I have this image here and I will drag it on there. You can see that it turns green and it's now showing up on the screen. And now that's been replaced. So that was easy to replace that. Now we head over and click above that, which is going to be the text. So number one, it says here, don't forget a towel. Well, that's not <laughs> part of Google AdSense. So let's change that. And I'm going to write um, YouTube ads. And then click back on it. And then a t <laughs> it says here a towel is the most important item a hitchhiker should can carry. <laughs> let's change that to earn revenue from ads on your videos. I'm just making this up on the fly here. Earn revenue from ads on your videos. Okay. And the same as before, when you click into it, you can literally change the font, the sizing, the alignment, 
um, everything. But I'm going to leave that as is. The purple, mm, I think I want to try black. I didn't really like the purple on there for a second. Okay, so now we'll play it from the beginning to see how it looks. Okay, now you don't have to have a picture, like you can also have the media be a video. So you can have video like a stock footage playing in the background as well. Now there was one thing I wanted to fix over here and I did want to move this font, I mean this text, to more center because it was a little off center to me. Maybe that was just a stylistic choice but I kind of want to move it to something like that. Now let's go on to the second one. So now I'm clicking to where the placeholder thing is again and I have an image here and I got these uh, from Pixabay. They're uh, stock free images. So I'll drag that on top there and then okay so now that that's on the screen. Now it's a little bit of a longer image but that's okay. Um, maybe I will stretch this out a bit more. This is just an example, so I'll just have something like that. But I do want to fix the text here because it's all kind of meshing in there. So now I'm going to click on the media here and the color of the number, maybe I'll change that to white and then the font color I'll probably want to change to black. Oh, um, but then her jeans get in the way so maybe we'll change that to purple but it's still a little bit in the way. Let me move let's see here now you do need to play around with things depending on what your media is. So let me just make this smaller again just for the purposes of this video. Make this smaller, resize. Okay, we'll do something like this. Yeah, there you go. Okay, now we have the towel talk again. Let's get rid of this here. So this one I was going to put affiliate marketing. And these are actual, like the first two points are an actual thing of how we make money off of our YouTube channel. And then um, promote other people's products to earn a commission. Something like that. Okay. So we've got the first one there, then the second one. Again, you can change the font, the coloring. All right. So now that we've done the first two um, tips, I'll play it again to see how it looks. glitched out there for a second. Nice. Okay, so that was the first two. And so basically I would go through this entire thing and fill out the rest of the information. Now, if I had to create this template from scratch, it would take way longer. 
it, the templates are really nice because they already set up the framework and you just need to do like a plug and play thing. They've already created the framing because if I had to go and create this circle thing, like this animation circle thing from scratch, that could easily take hours to do, especially if I've not done something like that before, you know, having to play around with it, do the animations. It would take time for sure, just on this part alone, just on that circle animation. And then the fact that they have everything all positioned and it just makes it a lot easier. So I do recommend using templates when you can. They have a bunch of free ones that are ready to go. And all you need to do is change the branding and the colors. And I would basically just go through the entire thing. I'm just doing the first two right now to show you guys. So there's still uh, number three, number four, number five. And then here at the end, which is the colors, which I did here, I would basically do the same thing. And then I would put something like this, the website, and then the colors again, and then the video would end. All right, guys, so that is how you use templates. Remember, if you don't know what they are, if you don't know where to find them, check out down in the description below because I will have that tutorial for you guys as well. And if you like these kinds of videos, you like these kinds of tips, feel free to check out my nine plus hour Camtasia course over over 70 lectures down in the description below. You guys can get two months free access. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.